Are you ready to enter the depths of hell? What's going on guys and welcome to another Refutized video. Hellfest is directed by Gregory Plotkin and stars Amy Forsyth, Bex Taylor Claus, and Rain Edwards. It's all about this psychopath who terrorizes these teenagers that goes to this horror theme park. He kills people, but everybody thinks that he's a part of the crew. Except for this one girl who figures it out and tries to warn everybody, but nobody listens to her. It's the classic horror movie act, pretty much. He just goes around killing people. He wears a mask, of course. And it's your basic slasher-type film. And this movie was right up my alley. Like I said many times in my other videos before, I miss the slasher age. And it's like the slasher age is trying to catch up again. Because we had Happy Death Day last year. Now we have Hellfest. Then we're going to have the new Halloween movie. Right on for slashers. Let them come. This movie was very interesting, as I stated before. Not that it's without its flaws, but I'll get to, to that in a little bit. It's, it's very little, though. The editing by Gregory Plotkin, who also directed it, and David Eaton was done pretty good. It wasn't too choppy. It was done just right. It wasn't like them saying, hey, um, film something over there, and then cut, film something over there, no, and then cut, no, 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 no. It wasn't like that. It wasn't like real fast cuts or anything. It was done just perfectly. The, the writing by Seth M. Sherwood, Blair Butler, and Akela Cooper was done really good. It wasn't cheesy. It wasn't like soap opera-ish or anything like that. The uh, story was concise. Like I said, it's just all about this serial killer who nobody suspect, suspects because everybody thinks that he's a part of this Hellfest crew and he just kills people and makes other people think that everything's fake. At one point in the movie, he actually stabs somebody right in front of the main character. I mean, I'm not ruining any, anything for you because it shows that in the trailer. That's how creepy this movie is. That's the vibe that I got. Gregory Plotkin's direction was done pretty well. He took it in a straightforward direction. Jose David Matero cinematography work was done really well. It wasn't like shaky cams. It wasn't too dark. It wasn't too bright. It was it was done just perfectly. It it felt like an actual horror movie the way he lit it up. It just had a really creepy vibe. It it, it just seems like something that could actually happen in real life. Because it wasn't little Asian ghosts or somebody rising from the dead, it wasn't zombies, although the producers of this movie are the same producers that works on The Walking Dead. So, a little trivia fact there. It felt real, and that's what I like. Horror movies that feel real are usually slashers. Don't have many of those around anymore. It's a shame. All right, the pros of this movie. If you're nostalgic like me, you will definitely love this movie. If you grew up with Scream, Friday the 13th, Halloween, and so on, you'll like this movie. It, it'll take you back to those times when you used to enjoy actual good horror. Again, yay for slashers. Bring them the hell on. All right, about the cons, like I said before, there wasn't much cons. But the only, only problem I did have with it was the jump scares. I hear this from other YouTubers a lot, that in horror movies nowadays, the jump scares are too predictable. Because everything's been done so much, it's kind of hard scaring people. But sometimes I'll go to the theater and watch a movie like this, and people will still scream. But I get where other YouTubers are coming from. I, I, I really do. But this one, it, it just, like some of the jump scares and some of the things in it, it just it felt a little predictable. But other than that, I thought it was an awesome movie. It will be here as soon as it comes out. You can guarantee that. But it felt like real horror is perfect for the Halloween season. Guys, Hellfest gets a B minus. I hope you liked this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I am still in the midst of doing the rest of the Halloween reviews, so stay tuned for that. What did you think of Hellfest? Whoever has seen it, Leave me a comment down below and tell me what you thought. Did you have as much fun in hell as I did?
I can't pull that off, I'm sorry. Like, subscribe, and get reputized. Peace to rip out.